Tripura is one of the beautiful hilly state among the eight states of Northeast India. The total geographical area is 10,491.69 square kilometer. According to 2011 census, the population of Tripura is 36,73,917. Among the 19 tribes of the state, Riang counts the second largest population with 1,88,220. Most of the Riang resides in North, Dalai and South districts of Tripura. Riangs are still nomadic tribes and a large numbers among them maintain their livelihood with hilltop zoom cultivation and other food gathering activities like collection of jungle foods, leaves, plants, fishing in stagnant water in a hill slope, hunting of wild animals, birds and so on. The Ryang communities are also found in Assam and Mizoram. They are also known as Brew. Today, our destination is in the most interior part of the state, where Riang community are residing. Today, we are going to see the famous Hojagiri dance of the Riang community. What a wonderful view! Everywhere greenery and we can hear the tutoring sound of the insects. Do you know what is the name of this place? The name of this place is Tisharangsak. We have arrived with all the crew members of Durdarshan after a two and a half an hour journey from Agartala. It's about 85 kilometers in the southeast part and it is near to Omarpur subdivision and we are here now to see this wonderful dance do you know what is it it is hozagiri they are being informed and we are excited to see them are you ready come with me Hello. beauty is the treasure of women and color is the pride of beauty for which each and every woman like to beautify themselves. We have reached our destination where we can see the beautiful ladies getting ready for their performances. She is Semoli Riang and she is wearing with full dress and costumes. It is Rangbok, about two cases and yeah about two cases and it is really all in the previous days these are made of silver coins and we can see here some of the clips uh, this is called Shanghai and it is used as a clip in the hair and really in in the previous days they are found of beauty especially the beauty of a lady is being known through its dress through its costumes every time color reflects to the beauty of nature and the ladies who are here are really attached with the nature for which every makeup every single makeup looks really beautiful and gorgeous the ring a bit larger in size and made in a such a crucial way actually is really beautiful and really it attracts and really to look beautiful this uh, this dress and costumes, especially the costume itself, it speaks a lot. And whoever have costume in her body, she's been regarded as a beautiful lady. So we are going to see this wonderful dance when they finish their own makeup. So take a look. This Hodagri is basically associated with my Klungmo rituals or a harvest related rituals. The Hodagri, it indicates night of feast or night of merrymaking. So this dance is a female oriented dance, but then there was male member who usually accompanied them by means of the musical 
instrument. So in this dance form, the female usually uh, try to perform all those stages that was being included in terms of your cultivation, be it from, uh, for example, your zoom cultivation. The stages that relating to zoom cultivation, right from your burning of the zoom till your harvesting of the zoom. So all the different steps are being identified and then they are being represented uh, through this Hodagri dance. So the female member, one important thing is that there was a very acrobatic dance involved in this uh, Hodagri. And there are lots of concentration that is required in this dance form. At last, we are in the final destination where the dance is going to be taking place. And these are the beautiful dancers who are ready from morning onwards. They are being prepared for this wonderful dance now. Just we'll look after a while.
Hi, such a beautiful dance you have seen it. Actually, the Hozagiri dance, the beautiful dance which is well known all over the state. We have seen the beautiful dress and costume which they wear, the melodious song which they performed, and also the rhythmic beats of the drums along with the uh, constant flow of the lyrics. So we have seen also the beautiful greenery all over, the sloppy hills, the narrow valleys and also the calm spirit of the area it really touches the mind so it is the time to wind up once again before we wind up i'd like to give you some of the beautiful program which is coming in front of us there will be different dances of different tribes of the state of tripura and till then keep your eyes on the look where we'll be bringing in front of you in the coming episode. Till then, goodbye.